Hello everyone. Welcome to my channel Rosa Technocrat. Today I am again here with a new video and this will be a very short video not uh, a lengthy video. So our today's topic is finding the maximums or limits on FortiGate. So how you can find what is the maximum limit or what is the maximum number of value that you can configure on a FortiGate or maximum number of objects, address, whatever. So from a configuration perspective, whatever the maximum that we can do is, uh, we will find out, okay? So the motivation behind this video is like, I got an uh, requirement from a customer where he wanted to know like how many or like what is the maximum number of address objects that he can configure on a FortiGate. So this number uh, varies depending on the platform version, but how we can identify. Okay, so that was like why why I created. So uh, whenever you want to know any maximum number of any configuration that you can do it on FortiGate, you can use a command that is called print table size. Okay. So print table size tells you the maximum configurable limits. Configurable limits means uh, the firewall configuration based on the configuration, what are the limits? So let's say you are co co configuring uh, VLAN interface. So how many maximum VLAN interfaces you can configure? Okay, so similarly, how many address objects you can configure, how many policy uh, you can configure, how many VIP address you can configure, how many anti-spam profile you can configure, how many security profiles you can configure. So basically, to find out the maximum configuration limits, okay, it's not about capability limits, like how much the device supports the bandwidth or how much traffic it can handle. It's not about the traffic, it's about the configuration limits that are on the FortiGate. So what we can do is, we can uh, use this command, print table size on FortiGate, okay? So this is a hidden command. This is a hidden command on FortiGate and if you type question mark or something, you will not find it. So the command is print table size, okay? When you issue the command print table size, you will see these kind of numbers, which may be like unknown to you, or you will think what are these. So I will explain those. Okay. So you will see the different sections of the configuration, like system VDOM, system data source. So the, so the first system is par, like under the system, what you can configure. Okay. Then in front of all these namings, you will see three values, 0, 0, 10, for example, okay? So here the first value is current usage. What is the first value? Current usage, how much you are currently utilizing, okay? The second value is per VDOM limit. Second value is per VDOM limit. Let me change the color better. Second value is per VDOM. So let's say if you are having multiple VDOMs, then this second value is the limit for a particular VDOM. Okay. So you cannot exceed or it will 48 will not allow you to configure the objects more than this. That is per VDOM. Then the third number is global. Third number is global limit. Okay. So global limit applies to the whole box. Second limit applies to the VDOM and first is the current usage. So let's take this as an example, system that VDOM. That means how many VDOMs I can configure on the FortiGate. Okay, on my FortiGate where I am executing this command. This means I can have a glo uh, the global limit or I can have a maximum number of VDOMs is 10. So my maximum VDOM is 10, okay? And why there is no limit or zero on the second one? Because VDOM, within a VDOM, you cannot have a VDOM, right? So this is zero. So maximum VDOM I can have is 
10. Okay, so that's the global limit for VDOM. Similarly, uh, a take system interface. Okay, system interface. So how many maximum interface I can configure? Okay, so I can have a maximum of 8192 interfaces globally. Okay, global interface. Global interface limit. This is uh, this is what all these numbers represent. This is current usage per VDOM limit and the global limit. So wherever you see 0, 0, 0 in all the places, that means unlimited. Like there is no limit. Specifically, there is no limit. Depending on what you are doing in the configuration, depending on it varies but there is no hard limit so 0 0 0 is there is no limit on this so vrrp there is no limit proxy arp no limit members interface members no limit so, these are the three values and this is how you can find out the maximum configuration limits okay not the capability limits so this command is print table size we go more further than you can see firewall address so maximum firewall address objects that I can configure on FortiGate is 20,000. So it can be either globally, okay, or in within a VDOM. So total cannot exceed 20,000. You have it on a single VDOM or you have it across 10 VDOMs, but the maximum number of uh, address cannot be more than 20,000 on a 48 so this this you can find okay then i had one more question from one of our youtuber or one of our content viewer harsh mittal so he had asked a query like what is the maximum number of remote servers that we can configure under ha so the maximum number of remote servers is 256 per vdom and 512 globally that also we will figure out in our video we'll do that how we can do that okay so you can simply issue this command print table size and you will get to know the configuration limits for any uh, value or like any configuration options that are available on FortiGate. let's do the lab lab time okay let's go to our lab okay here is my firewall quick it's our lab time so what you have to do is print table size okay when you issue the command print table size you see these values okay one problem with this is like they are not rolled over where you can see uh, one by one so rather all the values goes away in one sort so what you have to do you can simply log the putty session okay and then find out what you wanted or download this so either you can use simply the putty to 10 to 40 i will quickly log into my 40 gate okay i logged in and i have to enable the logging i will enable logging or printable output i will save it on my on my desktop okay okay and apply okay and then i can run command print table size see it will not show so basically it's a hidden command but if you type it keep on typing it will show you the output okay so when you do this print table size it uh, saved all this data see when we scroll it may not go up everywhere and you will not be able to grab what you are looking for because with this command the grab also doesn't work if i try grab interface see it will it will not just find out so the problem with these commands are first is this is a hidden command second is uh, grep doesn't works you cannot find out so what you have to do is you have to enable the logging save the output in a text file and then from the 
text file you can find out what you are looking for specifically okay so i saved the file on my desktop let's say uh, what the file was putty okay let me open the file now okay okay so here is my file i opened this was the log now what we discussed was let's say interface or switch interface so interface i told 8192 okay hers question was how many link monitor i can have hers metal link monitor okay so system dot link monitor 512 globally and 256 per vdom okay so you can have these number of link monitors configured so the answer to your question hers is uh, 256 remote servers you can configure and those remote servers can even be used under ha monitor because you are calling the same link monitor as a reference but this will have an impact depending on the priority that you have configured under the link monitor configuration and by how many points the priority decreases increases based on your configuration but you can have 256 per vidom 512 uh, globally okay then if you want to find out let's say address objects how many address objects or uh, let's see fortigate can have 20,000 firewall addresses configured let's say policy how many policy you can have security policy no this is different i think firewall dot security policy and policies okay policy i'm finding these are all different policies so basically zero 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 means there is no limit yeah so here is firewall dot policy you can have 10,000 policies uh, configured firewall dot policy 10,000 policies configured okay then either it's globally or uh, we don't whatever way you configure that's number of uh, firewall policy that you can have see these numbers differs depending on platform depending on the hardware so if your firewall is let's say smaller model then this number may be different and if your firewall is a bigger model let's say 4000 series or uh, 6000 series 5k 7k th these values may be 20000 40000 okay currently the value you are seeing this is for a vm firewall so my firewall is just a virtual machine uh, that is running so if i do a get system status get system status you will see sorry get system get system status okay what i am doing okay so if if i do a get system status you will see my firewall is a 40 gate vm running version 7 to 11 okay so on version 7 to 11 on a vm the limits are these okay so if your model is different these values may be different for you so here you can find all the limits that's a local in policy how many local in policies you can configure how many sniffers you can execute simultaneously how many ipsec phase one you can have you can have maximum 2000 phase one or tunnels okay and what else important four syslog servers you can have then how many router access list you can have like in the routing okay so all the limits are here basically so whatever you want to find out or verify just issue the command print table size okay hope this helps and this will be useful for you in answering your question uh, and your management questions about the limits on the firewalls with respect to the configuration Thank you. Thank you, guys. Thank you for watching. See you again on my next video. Bye-bye.